Hi, this is Baron Cruz from Charisma Matrix. One of the things that charismatic people do so well is to make people feel comfortable. This can really fly in any kind of situation. Now this tip that I'm going to teach you tonight is effective when meeting anyone, whether new or you've known them for a long time, but can be especially effective when meeting someone of the opposite sex or the same sex, whatever you're attracted to. Now what this is, is this is vocalizing someone else's discomfort or uncomfort before they have a chance to while they're feeling it. So let's take this for an example. Say we're sitting at a cocktail party and it's a little more upscale, it's suit and tie. And it's you and you're talking to this lady that you just met. And three kind of bigger rambunctious guys, maybe they had a few too many drinks come in, wild body language, very intense, intimidating tonality. You can see she just kind of her body language tenses or maybe it's just in her voice that she tightens up. But regardless, you sense that discomfort. Now what you're gonna do is you're gonna verbalize the discomfort in yourself before she has a chance to. Or maybe she wouldn't have whatsoever, but either way it's gonna show sincere empathy. So for instance, I'm gonna say, wow, it got a little rowdy over here. Let's just take a few steps over here. It looks nice and calm. We can talk a little bit more. Something like that to vocalize her concern before she has a chance to, or maybe she would just be shy and she'd sit there in discomfort and the conversation would go stale because she's not gonna be comfortable. She's not gonna be able to flow in the conversation. But either way, what you're doing is very powerful because not only are you mitigating her discomfort, but you're also showing a sincere uh, string of empathy which is very hard to find in this world. Most people don't either know about empathy and when it's correct to empathize and put yourself in other people's headspace, or they just aren't worried about it. Most people are just worried about themselves, you know? What's the first thing, for instance, that you feel when you step into a party? You're thinking, well, what's everyone else thinking of me? Are they looking at me? When in actuality, everyone's worried about the same thing. They're thinking about what's this guy thinking of me? What does this new guy walking to the party think of me? So to be truly empathetic shows a certain level of confidence that you are able to forget yourself, not worry about what other people think about you at that given time, and put yourself in someone else's head to help them feel comfortable in that environment to see what they're feeling. I mean, maybe these three guys come around loud and she's feeding off the energy and she's feeling fun. Well, in that instance, you could say, man, this party just picked up. I thought it was feeling slow. This is great. Either way, you're empathizing with them. You're getting in their head and that's gonna establish immediate rapport. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'm gonna be putting out videos hopefully every Tuesday at a minimum, Tuesday and Thursday if I feel really ambitious. Check out my iTunes podcast at Charisma Matrix and also check out my website at charismamatrix.com. As always, feel free to shoot me an email. Let me know your thoughts, any specific sticking points you're having, and I'll see if I can help you out. Until next time.